What is up, everyone? Well, <laughs> today's video is, uh, I don't i don't know what to call today's video, actually. I'm, I'm kind of having a hard time. Messy office, destroyed garage. Yes, today is all about getting a few things in order. We are reorganizing in there. We have hats, stuff everywhere. We did a big merch drop the other day, guys, and so I appreciate all of you guys that ended up with hats and some shirts and even some, uh, some little hoodies because the cold weather's coming. But we're gonna get this boat ready for a little journey. That's right, we are gonna be going off to Sam Rayburn. So, today's video, a couple of things. Today's video is, uh, I gotta get in the garage and show you this. I, I'm actually embarrassed to show you in the garage, but you, you're, yeah. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad. You get to see my, why am I doing this? This is, I'm not gonna show you everything, but this is a mess. I have clothes right here, we have to, get all figured out. We have a dead Minn Kota. Rest your soul. We have, it's dead. We have boxes and stuff to fill up. We we have some old shoes I need to do something with. These are not mine, these are my son's. Yeah. He's home from college, so we got half, that side of the garage is like literally stuff from his dorm. So look at this mess. This, this right here is total chaos. But there is, there is a little bit of some organizing in this pile of complete chaos. Yeah, we have swim baits, we have big easies, easy swimmers, we have stuff that I have bought over the years, right guys? I have Senkos, I have big Senkos. Weird buzz baits that I ended up buying, like spur of the moment, like you, you know, you get, you're like, oh my gosh, the buzz bait bite might be really good. So you end up going to the tackle shop and you get to buy three of everything. Now you're asking yourself, why do you have to buy three of everything? Because here's my rule on the three rule. It's an expensive rule, by the way. But my rule on the, for the three rule is that if you buy one, that's a problem because if you catch them on it, and then all of a sudden you're like, dude, I need some more because I'm gonna end up breaking this thing off. So then you're so scared to death that you're gonna lose the only one you have that you don't fish it right. And then you spend half your time trying to track down another tackle shop that might have them. If you buy two, then the minute you break one off, you're stressing out again, trying to figure out where to get one. Three is the rule for me, because if you break one off, you still got two, and you can kind of get by with two. But that being said, I'm going through all that tackle in there, and I gotta organize that. And that's part of today's video too, but the second part of today's video, which includes you, you watching, is I'm giving away some stuff. I'm giving away five big boxes to five of you, and you don't have to do anything for it. Like I've already picked the winners, so, like, you don't have to like the video, you don't have to comment on the video, you don't have to share the video, you don't have to do anything. I've already picked them, so stay tuned. Don't worry, there's five of you. They're, your names are gonna be on the screen, I'm gonna tell you who they are. And then I got something else planned. All right, so here's here's one box. I'm not giving the whole box away, but we're gonna be going through stuff, because today's today's a little, a little uh, cleaning up. We're in the process, okay? I was motivated Bradley Hallman, I watched your video. Getting your garage all cleaned up and set up all nice. Put your, your fishing rods on the wall, all like alphabetical order and all by like medium heavy and heavy and all this crazy stuff. I mean, who who has time for that, dude? But you did, you, I, you inspired me. So we're starting off by getting some boxes of stuff like this box. In other ones, they're just full. Oh yeah, this is a good box right here. This right here, I'll give you a little sneak peek. You ready? Now again, I've already picked five people. I hadn't told you who they are yet. But at the end of the video, we're gonna pick five more because I'm just feeling like giving away a lot of stuff. I might give away the whole garage. This might be like a whole video series once a week maybe. I don't I don't know. We're gonna be busy for the next month, so it probably won't be once a week. But at some point, I gotta get in here and I gotta get rid of some of this stuff. And I know y'all would love to have some of my stuff. I mean, it's 30 years of bass fishing tackle. That's a lot of years, man. Wow. All right, I got more. Guys, that is seriously heavy. Seriously heavy. There's classics in here, dude. Like this thing right here. A seismic, earth-shattering action. Seismic, earth-shattering action. I don't know, man. I don't know why I bought, I bought these probably seven or eight years ago, dude. There you go. They were biting them somewhere, I will say that. Evil twin. Oh, looky there, Scott Canterbury. Got Scott Canterbury, my buddy. This must be his little deal. 
Oh, look at that thing. All right, let me get the boxes. We'll go through this a little bit. All right, so we're gonna fill these boxes up right here. The ones I've sent my merch in, and I got a bunch of extra ones, so. We'll put whatever, it's kind of like a Scotty Tackle Box. Kind of like Mystery Tackle Box, but different, sort of. I like Mystery Tackle Box, but Scotty Tackle Box, which is today's video, is free. Totally free. But we will drop a link in the description down below for Mystery Tackle Box, because that is a really good subscription box. It comes with lures that are actually updated lures, because the stuff that I'm putting in Scotty's Tackle Box, not so updated. The stuff is a little, little old, but hey, it still works. But hey, real quick before we jump into it too far, you saw when I was down in the Keys not too long ago, I did a little, little lobster hunting, <clears throat> and we did a little deal, simple strap. I've been using these little dudes for lots of things, especially around here in the house, like with the pickup trucks and stuff. Again, driving back and forth with wood. We built some stuff back here behind the house. <clears throat> we had to have all that secure in the back of the truck. The simple strap is a all purpose rubber tie down, okay? They're totally reusable. They're rubber, so they don't get wet. They don't get all nasty. There's tie down straps that are always rusting. Like I have tie down straps, the ratchet straps, and they're always rusted. They're always just jacked up and nasty, okay? These are not that way. But I am gonna show you a cool little thing that I can use these simple straps for here on my bass boat. All right, so here's what I'm thinking. One issue that I've had with uh, power poles over the years is two things. One, uh, I've had the little remote one time in my pocket and jumped in my truck and drove down the road and the dang things deployed and that wasn't good. And then the other thing is just traveling up and down the road, hitting all the potholes, doing all the stuff that you do, it just wiggles them around a lot. And so I'm gonna cut this simple strap right here. Very simple. Cut that piece off. Totally reusable, okay? So we're gonna strap this right here like that. I'm gonna pull that around. Tighten it up real tight. Oh yeah. There we go. There we go. Look at that, guys. All right, just roll it like that. Tighten it like that. Oh yeah. That's perfect. There we go. There we go. Busted my shot, dude. I had the audio set. Everything perfect. Well, I just came by. Now we're getting copyrighted. You're getting copyrighted. No, you got two no, live crew no. playing. Off, yeah, dude. two live crew, dude. I'll get copyrighted. Luke, Luke no, and Campbell. No, he's that. hardcore on those uh, copyrights, man. He's throwing them all over the place, dude. I'm sorry, man. Yeah. Dude, I'm liking this truck. Do we need to take this mud? Yeah. Yeah. That'd be a whole other video. We can do that. Thinking. We just need to find the mud hole. I know where one is. I get a rip. I know where one is. <laughs> I know where one is for sure. So guys, we'll drop a link in the description down below. Check it out, simple strap. Cool stuff, but now let's get back to why you're here. That right there, fellas, is literally 100 pounds. All right, little live target bait right there. We can go in that box. Oh yeah. Oh, these are black twin tails right here. Fat Albert twin tails by Zoom. These right here, put them on the back of like football jigs. Put them on the back of a black and blue jig to swim it. Little twin tail is great. We'll put that in that as well. Oh, can't go wrong with some flukes. Oh yeah, put in that box right there. Bruiser baits, Cinco's, green pumpkin magic finesse worms. Somebody's gonna get that right there. I am gonna throw in Mondo worms. There is one missing though. So don't complain when you get this. Don't go, hey, oh, I, I need my other one Mondo. Just happened to be in that box and I have no idea why. Speed worms? Oh yeah. You know the damage we do on those. Tomato. Tomato. I'm not gonna know why. Why would I? I, I there's no way that I bought t tomato. I don't even like tomatoes. Okay. Oh, look at that. That's an awesome bait right there guys. Live target. Bluegill. We're gonna give some of those away. Oh my frog. This frog right here is legit guys. And that's the junior size. Live target, little crankbaits right here. David Walker made those. Listen, it's a good sound bait right here. We're gonna, give, we're gonna give some of these away. Red, red, oh yes, red. When that water temperature drops, guys, red, like drops in the low 40s, red for some reason, game over. Fill this to the literal, literal rim. All right, there's the five boxes. We got five more to pack up to go out 
to the rest of you guys. So all you gotta do is drop a comment down in the comment section down below and uh, let me know that you'd like to have a Scotty's Tackle Box. That's all you gotta do. All right, so we still got a lot of stuff left in there. Tons of stuff left in here. So here's what we're gonna do, guys. I'm, I, I'm just gonna give it all away. We're just gonna give it all away right here and we're gonna do another video. We're gonna give that away along with some fishing reels. I've got some Akumas here with the power handles. These things still work great. As a matter of fact, they still have braided line on them. So we're going to give away all that tackle and a handful of these nice Akuma reels right here uh, in another video. Called I Give Away My Garage. That's what the video is going to be called. It's called I Give Away My Garage. So be sure to subscribe to the channel because we are going to just do that. I don't know when that's going to happen. But in the meantime, enjoy the free goodies. Get ready for some major tournament videos coming up, guys, because we are about to hit the road for literally a month. Go to Sam Raver next week. And I've got to get the boat ready. We're going to get the, the garage all set. Right now, as you well saw, this, this garage is in complete shambles. But there is a little method to the madness. So we will give you a little reveal of the garage at some point. I don't know if I'm going to get it all done. But I am going to get it organized as far as this boat goes and my truck. Because the truck's in the shop. That being said, here are the five people that we have picked. So here's what I'm thinking about how to get a hold of us. So in the community tab on the channel, community tab on the channel, just go to it. You're gonna see a picture with me with those five boxes. All you gotta do is say, hey, I'm the dude, obviously that I've, you mentioned. I'm actually gonna match it up with your name on YouTube, so all is good. So first winner, pretty simple, Jeremy Duncan. Second winner, Michael Urich. Third winner, Will Sherman. Fourth winner, Brock Johnson. Fifth and final winner, for doing absolutely nothing except just being here and hanging out on the page every once in a while is the real angler. So guys, thank y'all. You're gonna someone ship you these boxes. Enjoy. If you catch a bunch of fish on them, awesome. If you don't, don't be mad. They're free. Okay. Yeah, next video is all about getting this thing all packed up and all ready to go. Because it's not really packed up and ready to go quite yet. Now I'll tell you what I'm excited about. I'm excited about this fall because Typically, we're done fishing tournaments in July or August. And this year, with the abbreviation that we've had with COVID, everything's been pushed back. So the season really is just starting again. So September and October and November, going to be bass fishing, get to hang out with you guys. So you guys probably have not seen that many tournament videos in the fall. So I'm excited about bringing them to you. It's going to be totally different types of fishing, different lakes. I mean, just going to be a lot of fun. So thanks for hanging out, guys. And I want a huge thank you to Yamaha. I don't know if you all saw the video that we did just a couple days ago where I unveiled my new motor for 2020 and beyond and uh, super excited about that to be part of Yamaha. So guys, thank you so much for all the support and we will see you later. Bam!